guys. Okay, this is like, I honestly thought that I would be starting around like noon. Um, but I did not wake up today till like almost 1.30, which is nice because I haven't been able to sleep in um, for like a while, like a good few weeks. Um, so this was nice, but um, my hair's a little goofy, so excuse that. Yeah, um, but I got a little dressed up because I want to go see Vincent later um, at work. But um, yeah, so I'm doing my makeup real quick and then I gotta get started here. Um, I threw in a bunch of thrift shops on like the way to TJ's, um, but there's other places I need to stop, like Five Below, because they have uh, Milky Way Midnights and he loves those, so I gotta go there. And then I gotta find a like craft store and get like twine or something, whatever that little like brown kind of rope thing is, like people using crafts and stuff. I gotta find that. Um, and then I need like little, I guess like clothespins, I guess. I gotta find some of those. Um, and then it should be good. But yeah, so that's kind of the game plan here. Um, mainly on the story, I'll probably like just be talking. I'll actually make like a vlog vlog. I don't want to, I don't want to spin my story too, too much with that. Um, so when I like, I'll post it up on YouTube and stuff. Um, probably after Valentine's Day, because I don't want to, to see it on accident. And then ruin the surprise, so. We are not about ruining surprises, and this looks kind of bad. This looks a little bad. Um, but yeah. So, they put me on cheese yesterday, on another note. Um, I was closing cheese. Vincent was closing it with me, so it wasn't bad. Um, but then he left early because uh, he found out his friend is, or one of his best friends is moving to Florida. Um, and so, he was able to leave early and go hang out with him, with John and Justin. Um, and it's cool because like, I hadn't met John before, but I'd met Justin a few times um, and stuff like that, and I'd been, like, in a call with John before, but I've never actually, like, met him, met him, um, so I finally met him yesterday, and he's very nice, and I thought that was really cool, I was very excited to meet, um, another one of Vincent's best friends, so I thought that'd be cool, they were very hyped, because Vincent told them about, um, I don't know if I said, but, um, I think it was Thursday, Thursday, Vincent and I went to go um, see what our ring sizes are and stuff. So he was telling them about that and when we want to get married because we have like a date and everything planned out. So they're really hyped and I was like, ooh, yay. Because I asked him, I was like, did you tell them what we did? He was like, I already did. And I was like, yeah. But yeah, um, so that's that. I'm very excited about that. Um, what else? That's kind of it. Closing cheese was super easy yesterday. Um, cause literally there was like nothing to like put out really. Um, but what else did I do? Uh, I have some homework that I have to do when I get home. That is like, I've been having a very bad bout of procrastination this week. Um, I have one assignment that was due on Monday. I have not done that still. Because I like, I fucked it up and then I like, I lose motivation to do it. Like do projects and stuff if I like mess it up somehow like badly, like I, I don't even, like I have to literally redo it and I'm just like, oh my God, you know. Um, so I haven't even like, that'll be the last thing I do today. It'll be the last thing I do today in terms of homework because I just, you know, uh, but yeah. So there was that. Um, and then I have another, I have two assignments that are late for another class. Uh, Luckily, he says that he doesn't care about grades, he cares about whether you understand stuff or not. So I hope that means that there's no late grade policy thing that he has. Like, I'm not, I'm not trying to do it on purpose, but it just, like, happens, and, you know. Uh, but yeah. Um, and then I'm gonna try to jump the gun and do everything else that's due tomorrow night, today. So I can just have shit done, and I need to get back on the track of doing that. Like, I'm supposed to graduate at the end of the semester, and I'm, like, fumbling right now. Like, hard fumbling, so I gotta, like, not do that. Um. But, yeah, so...
Oh, and you know what I found out? Um, Dutch Bros. I could not believe this. I was on like their Reddit or whatever, and I saw um, for Valentine's Day they're gonna be doing like little bracelets that you'll get like for free if you buy like two, at least like two drinks. And I was like, you know, and I don't want people to steal them from me when I can't get my hands on them immediately because they come out on Valentine's Day. And I was like, okay, well, I don't want to cost not being able to cop that. I'm going to be up at five to go get them. And before you go, Caitlin, holy shit, that's so early, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Wait a second. I have, okay, I just, I wouldn't have time to make it over there if I didn't because my Wednesday class starts at like 2.30 or so, ends at like 4.50, sometimes it ends earlier. Um, and by then, I think they're already going to be gone, especially because they're Valentine's Day, like, Dutch Bros bracelets. Like, I'm sure people are going to have the exact same idea as me and, like, try to get them before they sell out, you know? Like, I don't want them to sell out. And if you remember, like, almost two years ago, that is literally how I asked Vincent out. Kind of. That's how I hit on him. I got him coffee from Dutch Bros. So, if I can't get bracelets from Dutch Rose, I'm gonna be sad, but I will do my best to get them, and I will, I will literally be at fucking Dutch Rose at five in the morning to get them. I don't think you understand my dedication. I will do it. I don't care. Like, it's not like I sleep that much a majority of the time, so it's worth in my book. Um, but yeah, so I'm super hyped about that. Um, I might go to bed early that day, I don't know, or, uh, What's it called early? But yeah, I'm super hyped for that. Um, and then what else? I think that might be it. Um, obviously I'll pop back in when um I'm like, you know, checking out certain places or whatever. At least like, you know, doing my little log of where I'm at and stuff. But um yeah, I hope I'm hoping I find some good um like outfits for Vincent and stuff, some cute stuff. I really hope I do, but that's why I added so many thrift shops on my, um, what's it called? On my, uh, my Google Maps because I don't, sometimes it's a hit or miss. You could go through everything and be like, okay, there's nothing good here, you know, time to go somewhere else. So I gotta like, I'm hoping that I'll get lucky, but at the same time, like, I don't, I don't know. Like when I go thrifting, I don't find that much good stuff most of the time. I really want to go to estate sales, but I've not been to it. I haven't been to an estate sale just yet, but eventually I will go because they have really cute vintage furniture and stuff, but I'm just trying to blend this in really good, so. Sometimes my face is like pink a little bit and I think it'll die down once like, you know, it's like on my face for a bit. Sometimes after like, you know, rubbing my face a lot with stuff, it kind of does that. Oh. There we go. That's a little bit better. Okay, I'm excited. Let's get this show on the road. First stop is a thrift shop. Um, but yeah, uh, I don't even know the craft store or, um, Five Below just yet, but I will figure it out as I go along, so. Yeah, with that being said, let's get started. I'm so excited. I hope I found some good stuff. Okay, first stop was pretty good. Um, I will say, I'll show you what I got. Um, I, it's really hard to go thrifting because you do see a lot of cute stuff and I was like, I'm, I'm trying not to, I just, I have literally only permitted myself to get one single thing for me, everything else needs to be for Vincent. Um, but this sweater, someone made this sweater and it's so cute. Like it comes with this scarf, a matching scarf, but it looks, it looks like this. Oh wait, yeah, it, wait, where's it at? Okay, yeah, it looks like this and it's so cute. And I was like, okay, this is the one single, single thing that I'm getting this entire time. Like, I will not be getting anything else. It comes with the matching scarf. 
Um, but I got Vincent this Grateful Dead shirt because he he kind of is it Grateful Dead? Oh no, I'm sorry. I looked at one and I didn't. But I got him this because I thought that'd be kind of cool. He likes tie dye and some some fun like T-shirt design stuff. So I'm hyped. Um, but yeah, so that was the first place I went. Now we're gonna go to the second one. I gotta unbuckle real quick and take move my purse. Oh. I still need to do a haul for my cruise uh, trip that I went on. I'm still working on those vlogs. Um, but this is a purse I got in um, Honduras and it's so cute and I'm obsessed and I like, I haven't actually got, like gone out and like used it other than like being on the ship. So this is like the first time I've been able to like use it. So I'm so happy. But yeah, um, next stop is that second place. Hopefully we find some good stuff. I'm back from the second place. Okay. Okay. This was the second place. Yeah. Okay. Anything. I got a lot of cute stuff. I'm so excited. I think he's gonna think that this is super cute. Um, but let me pull it all out of the bag real quick. And then I also gotta kind of reorganize. Um. I think the next goal is to find him some more long sleeves, maybe. I did give him a few um, shirts. But yeah, let me show you. Okay, so first I thought this would be super cute when we go on our cruise later. Um, but I got him this. I think it's so cute. And he loves like Hawaiian shirts and stuff. So I think he will love it. I'm gonna throw some stuff in the other bag here too real quick. Um, but yeah, so I got him that. And then obviously some like kind of retro looking stuff because he's dating me. Um, so I got him, where's the top? Okay, and then I got him this. I think it's so cute. I love this so much. I think he's gonna think it's cute, I hope so. Um, but yeah, so I got him that. And then, let's see what else. And then I also got him another shirt. He loves button-ups, so that's why I have like a lot of button-up stuff, but I have this. I think it's so cute. Um, and then, let's see. And then I got like, oh wait, no, I have one more um, button up. This feels really soft, but it's it's really nice. I think he'd like it, just like a gray little button up. Um, so it's that. And then got him like something like a little bit more dressy. Um, I think it's super cute, and I definitely at some point we're gonna have like a dress up like date night and stuff. But I got him this, like you know, like one of those. Um, like long sleeves that goes underneath like the fancy jacket or whatever i don't know i guess but either way i got him one because i thought it was really cute um so i gotta here it's kind of like open because the buttons aren't like buttoned so let me just button it real quick and i was also gonna see if i could find some pants for him too um and get him like a few like ripped jeans and stuff but i didn't have much look here for that so eh let me button this real quick but yeah um in other news while I'm buttoning this up uh I ran into or well I didn't run into him he ran into or well he yeah um our um uh, one of our co-workers that became a mate at another store Nick um he came to visit our store yesterday and it was so nice um always a nice dude I always enjoy talking to him very funny um, his wife and him were expecting a baby, expecting a baby in like November. Um, so he was talking about that, and she's the cutest little girl. It's like, oh my god, I was so happy for him. But yeah, anyways, here's here's it like actually like buttoned up. So I'm excited. It's so cute and like fancy and everything. And all. yeah. So I got him that. Um, and then the last thing I got from here was another um, long sleeve. Let's see. Oh, actually, you know, while I'm talking about work yesterday, too, it was kind of shitty, not gonna lie. Um, I mean, for the most part, everything was good, and then it was, like, right before, like, Vincent left, it was just starting to get stressful, because we had multiple regs down, and some of them were still down. Um, like, when we took our lunch, there was, like, maybe four regs down, and then when we got back from lunch, there was, like, two. Um, and then when it was, like, an hour to close, there were still regs down. Um, and so there were still lines at like 8.30 at night and it was just stressing me out. Um, okay, here's, here's this, so cute. 
but yeah so this is the last long sleeve um that i got him but yeah anyways going back to the story um yeah so it was just like it was just really like stressful um you know because like uh all of that, and then, um, when he was leaving, I, like, I wanted to meet John, because I've never met John before, and so I was getting stressed out, because I had already pissed off, I felt like I pissed off my, um, the girl mate that, um, I reported for being condescending to me, um, I felt like I pissed her off, and I was like, okay, well, I was gonna go outside to, like, meet John, but now I can't, I don't think I can leave right now, because I feel like she's gonna write me up or something, so I started to get stressed, and then, like, I told him, I was like, can you, can you just bring them in so I can say hi and stuff? And so he did that, but, um, yeah, because I was just stressing out, because I told her, you know, she was trying to get Vincent on Reg, and I was like, no, this, this kid was supposed to be on Reg, like, he was on Reg, and then he went somewhere. But I didn't care that I kind of, like, I didn't necessarily rat out my coworker, but I kind of, like, I didn't know if he was on Reg, and if he was, then, yeah, he did leave, you know, but, like, regardless, like, you know, she was going to try to throw Vincent on Reg, and he was leaving at, like, 8.30, you know what I mean? So I was like, no, like, go find, go find someone else to go stick on Reg or whatever, and eventually someone else did. Um, and so, like, I felt like I kind of, like, pissed her off, and I was like, great, like, last thing I wanted to do today is, like, you know, obviously my, re my review will reflect my feelings on that, and I will be completely honest about it, so trust, trust. Um, but yeah, so then, um, it was like after he left or whatever, uh, she ended up sh like shutting my reg down um, to like collect the the cash from the door and stuff. Um, and she was like, "Oh, like you know, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna take your cash real quick or something." Um, and I was like, "Oh, okay." Um, and then she said something about shutting my reg down. And I was like, "Oh, like I I didn't know." Like, and I said I said that because like you didn't say, "Hey, like you know, Caitlin, we're gonna be shutting your reg down. If you want to hop like another reg, you know, whatever you can." Um, didn't say that, so I was like, you know, I was like, thanks or whatever, and I like walked to another reg to hop on, and you know, etc. And then eventually she was like, you know, like you can you can hop off, you're good or whatever. But I was like, yeah. Anyways, um, third place now. We're gonna hopefully find um, a few more long sleeves and a few more jeans. I'm gonna try to look out for jeans. Um, but yeah, so with that being said, fingers crossed for the next place. We'll see. Yay! Okay, I'm back from the third place. <clears throat> oh my god. Let me put on my belt real quick. But, um, okay, so I was able to secure jeans this time. Or, well, at least pants. Um, not like a lot, a lot, but I did find some stuff. Um, but yeah, so uh, let me show you what I got here. Um, I got him this i think it's so cute and it's really soft i tried to like i've been trying to go for like some soft stuff because you like soft things um so there's that and then for all right yeah i'll just kind of do it in the order that's in it. it's in this bag um and then we have these i feel like he'd really like these they're like they're really like comfy looking and soft but they're kind of like they're like i don't know i like i love pants like these and i think i think he would too so I got him those. If he doesn't like it, obviously, like, we could just like donate it or something. Um, I don't want him to feel like I don't want him to feel like he has to like keep everything up on him because like I'll make sure he knows that it's okay. Um, but and then this one, with like it, it's a little bit bigger than his size. Like it's an extra large. Um, I I think he'll still like it though. I think it's super cute. Um, let me button here so it like holds the collar together okay so I got him this I think it's so cute I love if you can tell I love these kind of shirts and it's like it's really comfy feeling um, so I got him that and then let's see, I got him another long sleeve um, I got him like a purple one because he loves purple um, it's, it's like a lilac color if you can't tell it's, it's kind of hard on camera but it looks it looks lilac um, and then I got him this, um, I got him, I found a pair of jeans, I hope he likes them, um, there, <laughs> yeah, so I got him, like, ripped jeans, little, little rippies, little rippies, but yeah, um, let's see, I think there's one other place I'm going to, maybe either one or two, I'm not sure, 
Um, I'm gonna try to focus on jeans and um, maybe a few more long sleeves. Uh, and then I think I should be good after that. Then I'm gonna get him coffee. I'll surprise him at work. I'll be there for a little bit and then I'll go. Um, I'm gonna go to Joanne Fabrics to get some of the craft stuff I need. Um, so I could work on, cause I like I have almost everything for my like my main part of my gift that's like sentimental, um, but I don't have everything just yet, and I haven't had time to get it. Um, so I do now, but yeah, so I'm gonna do that, um, and then I gotta stop at Five Below, um, and get him. Uh, I gotta get him his Milky Way Midnights. I think last year I got him like ten or something. Um, I don't know how fast he ate them, but I I do know that they're they like they were gone. Um, but yeah, so I'll get him that, and then I gotta, I think I'll run over to Target and get him, um, what's it called, um, I always, always, always have to get a box of chocolates. Have to, have to, have to. No exceptions. Like, that, that's a Valentine's Day staple, so I gotta get him that, um, and then I think I'll be done. Got a little bit more running around the deal. Yeah, let's go! Okay, this place was really, really good. Um, but I'm so sad because this was one of the thrift stores I went to and it's closing on the 17th. So I think there's like a, oh god, I don't even know how much. There's a very big like percentage off everything. I think maybe 75%. So I'll show you everything I bought for literally like almost seven bucks. It was insane. Um, but keeping on the trend of, you know, things I bought, um, I did find another long sleeve, um, which I will show you guys now. Yeah, so I got him another purple one because purple, he loves purple. Um, so I got him that. Um, and then I also got him a cute tie. I think it's fun. I like the print. Paisley. I love Paisley stuff. Um, yeah, so I got him a, I got him a tie. Um, and then I also got him a bow tie. Because um, I think he likes those more than ties. But I got him a tie just in case he'll ever wear it like when we go out, you know, like somewhere nice or whatever. Um, but I got him a bow tie because in his like little prom photos things, he has like little like cute little tux, little bow tie, and I was like, okay. Because he said when we get married, he wants to like wear a tie or a bow tie, and I was like, okay, you know. Um, but yeah. So, anyways, um, going on, I got him another pair of pants. These are oh, where, where's the front of the pants? Yeah, there it is. Okay, so I got him these. These are really soft. Um. And he has some like khaki pants, so I was like, okay, this is a safe, a safe bet here that we can go. Um, so I got him that, and then so I got him another pair of pants. These are also really nice. Um, let's see, I gotta refold it a little bit at least. Um, and then I couldn't see what size this was, so I really hope it's either like a large or extra large. I cannot tell. Um, I found a really nice like. Um, like jacket or whatever. Um, let me show you guys real quick. Very, very nice, very nice. Um, kind of like, kind of like a tux, I guess, sort of. I don't know. Um, but now he kind of has like the whole shebang because like he is like a the nice white, you know, long sleeve button up. Um, he has black pants that he could wear with that, etc. We want to get real fancy. Um, but yeah, so I got all of that, and now I'm done for thing. Um, I got to, I gotta go to Dutch Bros, and I'm gonna get him coffee. Um, and then after that, uh, Joanne Fabrics, uh, Five Below, Target, and then I get to go home after that, so. Yes, it was a successful thrift. Um, it's really hard, like, we said that we weren't gonna, like, spend that much, or at least we were trying to, like, be, like, budget-friendly or something. But it's really hard for me to do that because I like going big for like this like the little holidays like Christmas and Valentine's and his birthday it's like I like to do that like three times a year you know like I don't oh, know I like it it's very fun for me to do because he, he likes all of it so I'm excited um I will I'm I've been washing clothes actually today anyways before I left so I'll just throw everything in the washer when I get home um, but, yeah, I'll probably end up, I'll wrap everything, um, and I think that might be all I 
have so far. But yeah, I'm gonna go Dutch Bros, TJ's, and then uh, my other places that I gotta go. Um, but there might be some stuff, I'll have to figure it out. I'll have to ask my parents like what would probably be like dry cleaners, because I'll take stuff to the dry cleaners. Um, maybe today, if there's any open. There might be, I'm not sure. Figure it out, but it's like, oh my god. I hate, 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 hate going anywhere by myself. I hate it. I really do. Because, like, it makes me, like, nervous. And I get scared. Um, but I have my pepper spray. I have my little, like, taser ring. I'll be fine. But, you know, I still get scared. But, um, solo point and click adventure is almost over. Halfway done. Woo! <laughs> Just got Dutch Bros. Um, for Vincent. And... I confirmed it with one of the, the workers. I was so, oh my god, I swear, like, I'm starting to get nervous, and I get fucking awkward as hell when I get nervous, and so I was, like, you know, trying to, like, explain what I was asking, um, but I was, like, you know, like, I'm not sure if you know, you know, or, like, if you would know, but I was, like, you probably would know, uh, but I was, like, on the subreddit, uh, for Dutch Bros, um, it said something about maybe, like, having, like, Valentine's Day bracelets, and he was like, yeah, um, they'll be there, like, on Wednesday or whatever, um, and apparently, like, they stopped up more because, um, they sold out really good or whatever. Oh my god, my I'm not lying. Okay, anyways, um, yeah, he said that they went fast, like, last year. I forget what I was saying, but, um, yeah, he was basically saying, like, yes, we'll have them on Wednesday um, to, like, come in the morning, you know, um, to make sure you get one. And I told him, I was like, I plan on coming at, like, 5 in the morning. Like, I want to make sure I get them. Because I told him, I was like, you know, like, I got my boyfriend coffee before we started going out and stuff. Like, Dutch Bros, like, I literally, like, use Dutch Bros to hit on Vincent. So, like, that's, like, Dutch Bros has always been, always been like, our thing, you know. Um, so, I was like, this will be perfect. You know, so I will be up really early on Wednesday because I need to get it. It is not a want, it is a need. So, yeah, anyways, now I'm in the TJs. Um, the uh, Caitlin solo point and click adventure is almost coming to an end. I have a few more stops after this, like two more, I think. Three more, sorry. Um, and then I get to go home, so. Okay, I have. More, three more places to go. Um, I just finished having break with Vincent. Um, we were watching a bunch of tiki's and things. It was nice. Um, I put everything in the back of my car so he wouldn't see it because I had everything like behind the driver's seat and I was like, nah, I cannot do this. He had no idea what was coming. I was trying to set it up like I was like bummed, you know, that like we couldn't hang out, which is true. You know, like I couldn't see him because I'm not working. Um, so I like, I try to make him just like, like not expect me to show up and it's always like a surprise. Um, and I did that. So, yeah, happy. Um, I have to double check and see if Joanne Fabrics is still open. I don't know. Um, but if they are, I'm gonna stop there and then my two other places and then I can go home. So almost. Almost done. Um, I still have some, I have like a few assignments I need to do for college today, which I've not done, but they will be done today. I have to, I gotta stop procrastinating. It's really bad, like, it's really bad. I can't, I don't need to cost myself graduating. I need to stop. So, yeah, uh, that was my little update there, and I will show you guys what I got from TJ's um, little TJ haul. Because uh, I'm working tomorrow, um, so I'm not going to be watching the Super Bowl, but my dad loves these lemon bars, so I bought lemon bars. Um, I don't know if my mom's had them yet, but I bought them for them. Um, and then I got these. These are new. We got them last week, maybe, but they're chocolate, chocolate cheesecake bites. They're pretty good. It kind of tastes like mousse on a cake, but it's really good. So I got both. But both of those and we're almost done with the little outing today 
Um, after I get back, I will literally have to throw everything probably in the washer um, and etc. But yeah, so let's go to our next sum up. Okay, I decided I was going to settle on using um, oh my gosh, uh, yarn that I got last year. Um, it's like a purple lilac lavender looking yarn um, for the clothespins because I got this is what I needed. Um, and I'll need to super glue stuff too, but I we already have that at home. Um, I just did not wear these. But yeah, um, so I got that and now um, I can start heading back home, hit uh, what's it called? Uh, five below in Target and then done. Oh my god, I was out like for almost like eight hours. Okay. Almost at the last stop. Or well it's right over here actually. It's literally like the next building that I'm gonna move my car so I'm closer. Have a better spot. Um but Milky Way Midnights have been secured. I bought like ten of them. Um so hopefully that will last him a good little while. Because there's like two in each um each little thing. So I got him those. He loves these so much. Um, and see, I also got him two magnets for his fridge. And, uh, oh, they're both wait, no. okay, yeah. Um, okay, so gamer at heart because he's a gamer, obviously. And then love because it was cute. Um, but now is the last stop, which is Target. And I just need a box of chocolates. And then we are all set to go home. So there's going to be a lot of laundry for me to do. Kind of, but low key. Almost done. Okay, I did it. The last thing that I needed has been acquired. I got two, but I got him a little mini box of chocolates. They're Jiradelli, he loves Jiradelli. So I got that. Um, and then last year I got him like Dove chocolates and he really loved those, so I got them again um, this year. But, oh, now I can go home. Do homework, do laundry, eat, and just relax for the rest of my day. Oh my god, thank you for coming along. Um, hopefully you guys had fun enjoying, I guess, watching the vlog um, as I run around all the different towns and things. But yeah, with that being said, hopefully all you guys have a good Saturday, or rest of your Saturday, and I'll chat with you soon. Peace.